Hallelujah, Hallelujah to the Lord God, omnipotent reigning. Hallelujah, Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Hallelujah, oh, Hallelujah to the Lord God. Omnipotent Rene. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. To the Lord God. Omnipotent Rene. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. We want to thank God this morning. We want to bless the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ for giving us another opportunity of thanking Him, giving us another privilege of worshiping his majesty. We glorify your name. Mosareba conceal. De libas cora bastina masalia. Libra na soto basante ibascula. Jeleba inforama santele gugai. Ripla dos afatu maskia. We appreciate God. We glorify Jesus who was and is and is to come. We thank his precious name. So I want you to lift up your voice wherever you are and say, Lord, I thank you. I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord. Mose canibaria Doshe le bon cafin tromosta Rabos kindelebos coprana mutalebos Rapande impaude solabo Zenko varamos kindelebo kasai We give God the glory in the name of Jesus Christ. Before we pray, I want us to read. Colossians chapter 3. Colossians chapter 3. I'm going to start from verse 1. I'll read verse 1. And I'll go to verse 5. Colossians 3. If then you were raised with Christ, seek those things which are above where Christ is sitting at the right hand of God. Therefore, put to death your members which are on earth, fornication, uncleanness, passion, evil desire and covetousness, which is idolatry. Because of these things, the wrath of God is coming upon the sons of disobedience, in which you yourself once walked when you lived in them. But now you yourself are to put off all this anger, wrath, malice, blasphemy, filthy language out of your mouth. Do not lie to one another, since you have put off the old man with his deeds. And have put on the new man who is renewed in knowledge 
according to the image of him who created him. Where there is neither Greek nor Jew, circumcised nor uncircumcised, barbarian, Scythian, slave nor free, but Christ is all and in all. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. The evidence of being raised with Christ. Hallelujah. The evidence. It is unfortunate these days that even people, you see man marry man, woman marry woman, gay, lesbian, everybody screaming, I am for Christ. When it is clearly written, that you are blaspheming God when you indulge in this kind of lifestyle. So, I want you to understand something. That there is an evidence of those who have, who have been raised with Christ. Number one is that you will begin to seek the things which is above where Christ is sitting in the right hand of God. You will set your mind on things above, not on things on the earth. Hallelujah. Now, what do I mean? Do you mean that we should not be thinking about things that are on earth, our children, things that are on earth, our materials, our wealth, our finances, all those things are important. But the Bible said, set your mind on the things above. Now we check what are the things above. God, Holy Spirit, the directions of the Holy Spirit. Do you realize that there is nothing that is created that is not created by the Holy Spirit. The Bible says, in the beginning, in the beginning, the whole world was in darkness, total darkness, void. And the, the, the Spirit of the world, the Spirit of the Lord moves upon the waters. And the Lord said, let there be light. Hallelujah. Who was speaking? The Holy Spirit. The power of creation is the Holy Spirit. And the same Holy Spirit dwells in you. Hallelujah. Instructing your spirit on what to do. Addressing your soul on which way to follow. You must be inspired by something. It's either God is inspiring you or devil have you in his hand. You cannot be empty. You cannot be neutral. Hallelujah. So I want you to understand that you set your things above. Set your priorities on the things above. Set your priorities. The Bible said, put to death your members. How do you put to death your members? All right, let's 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 analyze it. One of your members on earth is fornication. Fornication is a member. You know what a member is? It's part of you. It's some, it's something that you you were born with. It's part of you. 